did not say a thing when Obama turned up that giant indoor tented open flap birthday party complete with maskless friends and really bad dancing. But they did come hard for our next guest. South Dakota Governor Kristi Noem is here to respond to the controversy over the famous Sturgis bike rally in her state this weekend. That's it. Oh. I got a, I think it was a, in between 2012 and 2000, wait, I think it was in between 2010 and 2000, the year 2010 to 2015, that I got hit with some serious charges, but then in between, in between, I don't. I'm not quite sure. I can't remember. It was a while ago. I think it was in between 2010 and 2015. Now I got charged, or they're trying to. I got arrested on some serious charges. Let me finish. Hold up. Let me finish eating my Kentucky Fried Cracker, my Kentucky Fried Chicken. But. The thing was, is I went to, I went to jail and got bonded out. I went to court. See, that, a lot of people think this is not a game to me. And I can't change the world. The world is going to be what it is until however long it lasts. But there ain't nothing I can do about things that are going on in and out of the world. They're trying to hit me with some serious charges. So let me put it like this. I'm not going to say no names, but I went to the hearing. And then we're, we were trying to do the sentencing and everything. And th these were serious charges. I mean, a lot worse than what I'm going through now. But I hope the judge and my lawyer and the prosecutor understand what I'm about to say. These were way worse charges than what I'm being charged with now. It should, when it comes to me having money, a woman, that shouldn't be a problem at all. That, that, that's why I'm acting and saying and doing what I'm doing because you guys are turning this, this little hill and this little, little lump in the sand into a mountain you guys are making the situation with me and my family and my in my neighborhood in battle creek michigan in america the work in the world way worse than what it ought to be in other words these charges that they tried to hit me up with back then were sir they're a lot worse anyway i'll say this the parents of the girl were, they were sub subpoenaed to go to court. The girl didn't show up and her parents didn't show up. And the prosecutor, the judge and the lawyer came to it. They, they were subpoenaed to go to court. They didn't show. The judge came out. He said, go out there on the hall. I went out in the hall. He came out and said, go home. I was mad as hell. I was happy that, I, that you know, about being dismissed. But I was like, you guys made me look like a goddamn fool anyway. He said, go home. I said, that's cool. I don't mind going home without having to do anything else. But you motherfuckers in Battle Creek got me mad as hell. Always oh, trying to hit me up with some stupid-ass charges of a, of, of a crime or incident that was really... I think, I think God and the devil see these human beings trying to play this situation for as a game or um, survival of the fittest or winner takes all. This ain't Highlander. This is not Highlander. Is this is this what Highlander is? You remember Highlander? No one lives forever. Let me think about it. 
is what it is, survival of the fitness, winner takes all, Highlander. But anyway, the lawyer came out and told me to go home. There comes a time when you're dealing with a public health crisis 